at Highland Hills Middle School. We have a special guest here with us today. If you could please stand to be recognized. We have Dr. Louie Jensen, our assistant to the superintendent for secondary. Dr. Steve, Dr. Steve Griffin, our assistant to the superintendent for middle schools. And our former principal here, Dr. Tony, or Mr. Tony Duffy, assistant to the superintendent for elementary schools. Sharon Jones, our Director of Student Programs and Cultural Responsiveness. Michelle Faree, Director of Student Service Support Services. Sally Jensen, Director of Assessment and Student Information. We have Janine Corson, our Human Resource Director. And we have some school board members with us. So Elaine Murphy, our school board president. <laughs> Becky Gardner, school board member. And Elizabeth Gallagher. We thank everyone for being here. Thank you guys so much. We are here this afternoon to recognize the accomplishments of a special teacher that represents our entire school community. This teacher finds joy in each day she works tirelessly to ensure her students have the same educational opportunities and creates a unique learning environment in her sensory classroom. She served in the United States Air Force prior to going into public education, where she taught other nations commanders how to best defend their nations. She strives to have patience when dealing with difficult moments and is always kind and respectful to others. She's enthusiastic and ready to face the challenges that come her way. No matter how long you've been a part of Highland Hills, it only takes a brief moment to recognize what a special educator Jenny Luttrell is to so many. Mrs. Luttrell has truly made an impact in the world and she is a gift to education. It is an honor and a privilege to recognize Mrs. Jenny Luttrell as our Teacher of the Year and for the New Albany Floyd County School Corporation with the WHAS Excel winner. We have here with us from WHAS, Haley Minog. Please give her a warm welcome. How's everyone doing today? Good? Good. So I got the chance um, to spend a few minutes before uh, today's ceremony in the classroom with um, Ms. Jenny Luttrell. And um, from the moment that we first met her, it was like full speed, full speed, full speed. Like, here we go, we're going down the hallways and we're gonna take a left right here to here. But as soon as we hit that classroom, everything went to slow motion. The attention to detail, the attention to students, the patience, everything just stretched right out. And it was so amazing to me to see a teacher who can have those two different gears. I mean, that's that's crazy. I don't, I don't, it, even a person that has those two different gears. That's so great. And it's so amazing to watch the way that she works with students, the care that she gives to each student, listening to her talk about the different uh, needs of each of the students, the range of the students. It's, it's a lot that she has to do every single day. And she had a huge smile on her face the entire time talking about it. She, yeah, and she always does, is what it sounds like. So um, it was very interesting, too, hearing about um, your military past. I can't imagine going from, you know, working truly in the trenches kind of situation to being able to flip and be that kind, um, just accepting and nurturing person. That is so amazing. And you are such a strong, special person to be able to do those things. So now um, I'm going to go ahead and present you with this award. If you want to come up here, I'm going to warn you it's very heavy, so don't let it get you when I hand it over. Okay. So um, I am now extremely honored to be able to present you this Excel Award on behalf, behalf of WHAS 11 and lg &E KU. So congratulations to Ms. Liz Luttrell. You are an Excel Award recipient.
guys so much because all those kids that you're sitting around are not only special to me, the school district, but everybody. But you change their lives as much as I do, and I couldn't do this without you guys. So thank you very much to all of you because without it, I couldn't do this each and every day with that smile on my face. So thank you. for being here today. I want to thank WHAS and LG&E for their contributions to this. Special recognition um, to all of our central office staff and to our school board members. We thank you for all of the service that you give to us and to all of the students who help um, make Highland Hills what it is today. So just let's give one more round of applause for Mr. Stone. Thank you all.